going everybody? Pond Hopper 23 here, back with another fishing video. As you can see, we're at this lake right here. Haven't been here in over a year, so today I'm going to be fishing the bobber and some worms to see what we can catch. Let's get right into it. All right, well, this is the setup we're gonna be using for today. We have our worms right there, that spinning rod right there, and then the mini rod on a bobber and some worms. So the bait for today, like I said, are these worms. So uh, that's what it looks like. And look at that. They gave us nice big worms, so um, let's just go ahead and throw that on these rods. So. so you get about a little bit on the end just so it gives us some action. And we will go ahead and cast this one out. A little bit windy today but I'm hoping we can just still catch some fish and uh, see what's going on in this lake. Cast it out, so nothing yet on that other rod, but now that we got two out, hopefully I catch it and I'll keep you updated. He is just absolutely hammering this, but he hasn't taken it yet. It's his first bite on the day though, so. That's a plus. It's really windy, so sometimes it creates those like, little waves and like bobber. Yeah, just like that. Uh, hard to see my bobber. Wow. Maybe I just shouldn't say anything about the wind. Because I think when I say stuff about the wind, uh, the wind picks up by 20 miles an hour. Wow, okay. Okay guys, this uh, rod just got hit. Bobber went down for a little bit. Came back up, so we got a bite, but I'm hoping he's gonna take it again. Oh, yeah, there's another little bite. Just been nibbling, but waiting for the takedown. Look at this. Fish ended up taking all it's pretty much all the worm, so. Put on another one, cast it back out, and still searching for the first fish of the video, but I think we'll get it. Just put on that water worm. Hopefully it's not too much. I don't think it's a bad thing, so. Yeah, gosh, every single time I talk about the wind, it just gets even windier, so. Oh, got another bite on this rod. I saw, oh, wait, 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 nope, this one's under. I think I'm getting bit on both. Oh, gosh. Just got bit on both rods at the exact same time. Go around this tree. waiting there it is no missed it oh what okay well I missed that fish but this rod is still getting hit so who knows hope you guys are still enjoying it and I'm still definitely gonna try to get that first fish of the day, but oh, I got two bites on the same rods. It's just every single time I go to the other rod, the other other one would get bit. So throw this back out there, and I'll get the other one ready. Well, this rod again is getting hit. A little bit of parkour to get around. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Dang it. Cast it. 
back out. All right, fifth or sixth time, hopefully. It's the charm. Okay, so since I can't catch a fish at all, um, I've decided to take off the bobber and hope and pray that that helps at all. Because I've been sitting over here for the past like 20 minutes. I've gotten like a bite every single like 10 or 15 seconds. And then they just take it, but then when I set the hook, or, cause this one, this one's a, uh, this one's an octopus hook, so I, I didn't set the hook, but on that one I did, cause it's not. Uh, they just keep on taking it. So, maybe, without a bobber, uh, they might just take it better and not keep on spitting it, so. I will let you know if it even works. I hope it does. If it doesn't, I might cry, but it's okay. So, uh, I mean, I know what fish there is, uh, like, I know what fish are in here, but can't, can't catch them, so. Oh my gosh, no! You're joking! Oh! Okay, that gives me a lot of hope. Even though I've been saying that like 90 times. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I set the hook right as he, um, right as he, uh, took it. Because what I'm doing, it's actually helping because I see the bite better. Because with the bobber, I just don't, I don't really like it. But with this, when I'm, uh, tightening all this so there's no slack. The end of the the rod goes straight down. Well, still looking for the first fish, but that gives me more hope. That was that was better. Yes, there he is. There he is. Please stay on. Stay on. Yes. Yes. We did it, we did it, finally. Oh my gosh. After about 20 bites, three hours, and who knows how many worms, we finally caught the fish we were looking for. Even though it's a small guy, I could care less. Um, they're the little bullhead catfish. Really, really pretty. Gotta watch out, though, for their fins, because these little catfish will stick you and it does not feel good. Look at that. He's just gonna take my entire worm. Okay. Look at that. Has my entire worm. Oh. So... There it is, small little guy, but we do not care. A fish is a fish. They're really uh, unique and interesting to, to see. Not always really fun to catch, so I will go ahead and release this little guy. I hope you guys are enjoying the video so far. If you are, make sure to like and subscribe. And we are on the road to 600 subs. So thank you for all the support. And I hope you enjoyed the rest of the video. The thing about these catfish is uh, sometimes they nibble. But once they take it, they just run off with it. So, oh my gosh, again, this wind makes it near impossible for me to tell. Oh, that's a bite. There's one. Yes. Wow. He just absolutely took it. Just as I was saying, when they take it, they absolutely take it. Number two on the day. This one's a pretty much common one. The other one looked a little different. This one is pretty much. And as you can see, it's about the same size because it's about how how big they get 
I'm hoping he did not swallow that too deep. Okay, it's not too bad. There it is, there's the hook. Got him. Absolutely hammered it, bro. He almost took it in the water. No! Oh! You're joking. Okay. Guess I'll just try again. Yeah, but anyways, um, my mom was texting me, and I look over, and my rod just, like, down here. Almost flipped over the chair, which would probably have a rock right there, but it's okay. Getting bit. Oh gosh, there's one. Got him. Wow, look at that. Fish number five on the day. Oh, I'm getting bit. Oh, got him. Oh, what? Is that a shiner? Yeah, it is. Wow. Look at that. That would be absolutely perfect for pike but i'm not i'm not doing any pike today i don't have my rod interesting it's like the oh it's like the first or i think it's like the first or second one i've ever caught here i wasn't even sure if they're in there yeah that's really cool though I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you did, make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.